the movie Coco. One. Investigate about the Day of the Dead in Ecuador, Mexico, and Spain. What are the differences or similarities you find? 2. Read the following review about the movie Coco and answer the questions. A young boy called, Miguel, dreams of singing and playing guitar, just like his movie star hero, Ernesto de la Cruz. But there's a problem, generations before, his great, great, grandmother's heart, Coco, was broken, when her musician husband, abandoned her. Since then, she has forbidden the family, from playing music. Miguel can't bear the restriction, but when he steals a guitar from his idol's tomb, he is transported to the land of the dead. He discovers he cannot get home unless he finds a deceased family member, to give him a blessing. To do that, he teams up with the dead, man Hector. It was very hard, to establish the rules, of the land of the dead, when the deceased can visit the living, but once that's done, the film ends in a touching finale, through spectacular musical numbers. Local Mexican foods and traditions, such as alebrijes, Folk art sculptures of fantastical creatures, are everywhere. Miguel has to find peace in the land, of the living with the help of the dead, and the way he does, so will make anyone cry. Look at the film review Coco. Answer these two questions. You have 10 seconds. Answer the following questions. 1. Deduce the meaning of the following words, from the context. Write an X in the correct space. 2. Why do you think Miguel can't bear the restriction of playing music imposed by his great-great-grandmother? 3. Make a list of five adjectives you can identify in the review. 4. What Mexican tradition did the film review mention?